This clip is brought to you by VegasWinners.com. Get expert sports betting advice from some of the best handicappers in the world. Head on over to VegasWinners.com and win yourself some money. He had a few things to say to the Stallion. Got a little bit of intimidation right there. Oh, yeah. He is so confident, Arn Anderson, that he can win each and every match. And that's very important for any athlete to be like that. Yeah. Tony, you know that match starts as soon as you walk out of the dressing room. You know, which wrestler is going to come out first? How long does that wrestler that's out in that ring has to stand there before the other one come, comes out? The way the man walks to the ring. He looks at the other wrestler. It is something. The young man, the fan stand, takes him, flips him out. Good move. He has to stay on him, though. All right, now see, there, Tony. The stand just waited a little bit too long to go in after Iron Anderson. Gave him time, put that knee right in the midsection. Now he starts to pound away. Just goes to show you what a couple of years more in the sport will do for you as far as your ring savvy. And better believe it if you're a member of the Anderson family you got plenty of it yes you do Tony we were talking about Philadelphia starting on July 1st the great American Bay oh Gord Buster Gord Buster right in the center of the ring that is it no more Italian state in this match he was real confident coming into this match and there's why he is an Anderson he is tough and he is still the world television champion with an impressive win, David, right here. Fans, once again, watch the gourd buster from Arn Anderson as he makes quick work of the Italian giant. Arn Anderson's your winner. He is still the world TV champion. We'll have more action right after this timeout. He is an Anderson, and he is tough. He's built for tough. That's Arn Anderson. Right. So, so listen, you take out the Italian stallion. What are the first few things that immediately pop in your head when you hear the name, the Italian stallion? Well, a lot of people weren't aware, but stallion had a side job besides breaking in the wrestling business and and he was a good amateur big strong guy he probably weighed 265 pounds and just more so than weight strength you know weight lifting strength you just walk in your house and pick up your refrigerator and walk out with it that kind of strength but he was now i'm just going to you know this is rumor and no names mentioned but if you owed somebody money and you didn't pay up Stallion is the guy that they sent to collect the money. Let me just say that we kind of called him a, you know, a leg breaker, but it was ribbon on the square. Uh, he never would admit to it. He would just smile. But, you know, if you were sitting there with your family eating dinner and you looked up and that was Stallion st standing behind your wife, you better pay off. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I feel it. I get you. And I don't think a lot of people knew that. It probably couldn't be proven, and I'm not calling any names, but let's just say he could. He was a handful in that ring. Hmm. He looked like he'd be a fun guy to go out and eat a nice meal with, though. I mean, he looked like he knew how to eat. Oh, he could eat? Yeah. And I think that was another one of those things that was like a, a trait of his that, that people just knew that he could really – mow down some food hmm. so i'd like i'd like him on that side and yes paul it's bringing up food again guys some guys are going to give me a hard time you can't have a podcast without talking about food can you brown well well listen on 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 to some more fun and it's you on the mic things are moving to the summer okay you knew that was happening hey hey it's conrad thompson thanks for checking out the podcast here on youtube be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.